Manhattan in Amber Alert in New Hampshire ends with guns drawn as New Hampshire police take a father into custody. Dustin Duran was a wanted man accused of abducting his two young children. They are safe tonight, but he's facing far more serious charges. Thank you for joining us. I'm David Wade. Police believe that 37 year old man shot and killed the mother of his children in her Berlin apartment. Tammy Mutasa reports from where the suspect was arrested in Keene, New Hampshire. Tonight, a community of witnesses, Good Samaritans and detectives are so thankful those little girls are safe and sound after that dramatic Amber Alert and extensive search. But now police say their father is accused of shooting their mother to death. And the question is why? It's very traumatic to watch something like that happen in real time. This was the dramatic end to an Amber Alert search for two little girls. Their father, Dustin Duran, cornered by police, now accused of shooting their mom to death. The officers with their guns drawn in the Keene Applebee's parking lot is what caught Tanya Hansen's eye. The little ones, um, you know, were clearly distraught in the situation, so it, it was it was a little rough to watch it go down. It was scary, you know, uh, watching police draw weapons on someone. Darren should also be in possession of a handgun and if located stop and hold use caution. Police had been looking for Duran and his one and four year old daughters since Thursday night. The girl's mom, Caitlin Navziger, was found shot in the head in their Berlin apartment two and a half hours away. Now Duran has been charged with a 31 year old's murder. Can't indicate whether they were present when their mom was shot. I can say that they were found. They are safe and they're being cared for. Workers and witnesses who spotted the white Subaru in the Applebee's parking lot didn't realize the circumstances were far worse than the Amber Alert. It was a white Subaru on the Amber Alert, and that was a white Subaru right over there. There was about three cop cars that came racing in here. Cops jumped out of the car, like immediately had their guns drawn. When it was all over, Tanya offered officers snacks and blankets for the little girls who had been through so much. Just wanted to make sure that they were, you know, feeling secure and safe. So, and the officers did a really great job of just cuddling them and trying to, you know, keep them calm through the process. The community now left wondering what went wrong for the family in Berlin. As a mom, I can't, you know, I can't even imagine. I'm just hopeful for the kids that they have other folks in their lives that can, you know, help them heal through this traumatic experience. We're told the children are safe and in state custody. As for Duran, he's expected to be arraigned on Monday. In Keene, New Hampshire, Tammy Matassa, WBZ News. <laughs>